a shield outside. But we do the, we call this outside uh, outside backhand. It's the same movement. So if I'm doing inside, uh, imagine you're attacking me. I'm doing inside, and then he attacks me again. I'm doing outside. So basically, it's a mirror image of the shield, but it's an outside backhand. Yes. So basically, I've got this. He comes again. I've got this. Yes. 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 Right. So I've got this. I've got pass. I've got the backhand. Now with the backhand, you see how we've got reference points for everything. When I do the shield, the reference point is sector two to the shoulder. When the pass, sector three to up to the shoulder, down to the hips. So basically, when, when I'm doing the shield, yes, I'm supposed to be hitting him, boom, boom. When I'm doing the pass, I'm supposed to be hitting him, bum, bum. But with the backhand, I don't want to go like this because it's opening me for that cut. So now this is just a clearance, then I touch him, floating, fl touch him with the lips. Yeah, so in reality, I come, I come to attack me, come here, that way. Yes, I want that to be a habit. Yes, so once I'm here, I touch, and I raise turn, back hand, he touches. Raise turn, here I touch, raise turn, touch. And here I touch, raise turn, touch, here I touch, here I touch, here I touch, here I touch. So when you see him chamber, you already that. See, I'm reaching for him again. But I'm not hitting him with this, I'm hitting him with this. Mm. So that's why when you guys are twisting, so I'm sliding, sliding, I twist, this is what's hitting him. So you're hitting him with your body, not like that. Yes, we come to attack me. Twist. Twist. Set two, set two, set two, set two, set two. And when you guys are clearing the hand, yes, again your reference point is, see, my shoulders, set the two, past the shoulder. And then you pull back, he chambers back. Okay. So do not drop this, do not drop this down. Once you drop this, you're funneling the blade towards your face. Yes? So if I'm here, if he tries to change his cut downwards, boom, I've got this hand. But if I funnel it down, then see, I don't know where it's going. Okay. Make sense or not? Where you place the blade, or where you take the reference point, is how he will cut you. But if you're guiding him downwards, I'm guiding him here, stay safe. I do not know if it's going to go straight up here or horizontal here. So if it goes <coughs> up, it's correct. If it goes horizontal, then it's there. But if I stop on the shoulder, there's only two, two ways, he, one way he can go. He has to go under my arm. When he goes under my arm, it's always this way. So I just cut and it's that, that cut, continue. See that? Yes, yes, or not? yes, yes or not? So just by dropping your hand a few inches, you give him two options. Take away one option by, do not, by not dropping his hands. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, yeah. So, okay. so sector two, shoulder, and stop. Do not drop the hand. As I pull back, he pulls back. I attack him, he pulls back, he touches. Boom, now he pulls back, I pull back. Alright, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. I only the backhand. Only the backhand. I